At Southern Connecticut State University, I believe that I could be able to meaningfully contribute to both the department and to the profession of speech pathology. I believe this because of the personal experience that I've had with the speech pathologist. When I was in high school, my dad was diagnosed with ALS, and his speech language pathologist gave us so many resources to be able to communicate with him. He personally used an alternative and augmentative device to communicate with us, and at the time, I had no idea how advanced the technology was. And because of this, I became interested in researching and learning about AAC devices and the entire technology aspect of communication disorders. Because I know the genuine effects that SLPs can have on a patient and their family, I know that I want to be the person that can do that for someone else and help them communicate with their loved ones. Um, I would always advocate for the speech and hearing impaired and as I continue my education and begin a career in speech language pathology, I would continue to do so. I feel that since I've first-handedly seen what a speech therapist can do for their patient and for their family, I know that that's what I want to do for someone else. I want to do the research and learn all the new strategies, the new technology, the best ways to improve a patient's communication. Um, if accepted to Southern Connecticut State University, I would continue to learn and research and figure out the best and newest ways for people to communicate. I would work my hardest and use all of my knowledge and information that I have learned to be the best speech language pathologist that I could be. And I would continue to advocate for those who cannot communicate and give them the opportunity to be able to communicate with their loved ones again.